What's up? It's Grim. Decided to check in. Yeah. What is my Nexus Ultimate dog down there. Nice dream scene background that I made. Yep. Yeah. Gonna get naked here in a second. Whoa, we can't show that. Can't show that. How about something a little more G rated? What is thy bidding, my master? Yeah, I got Vader sounds, uh, Vader's voice. Anytime I uh, uh, make the dock come out of its auto hide, and uh, then there's like the eerie Emperor's throne room choir playing. Oh, there's the new Firefox icon I just made. Um, As you wish. Then of course it says that when <laughs> I choose something. Um, yeah, so I've got you know uh, sounds attached to the dock now, and um, this is really what I want to show you is the uh, the the clear glass transparent uh, windows that I have. Um, you notice it's got like a little purple tint to it because if you have it just like plain clear, uh, there's like uh, colors and shit that can appear behind the words, the titles, and it makes it hard to read and shit. So um, it's best to tint it. Uh, so since like you know, I like colors like blue and purple and shit like that, I kind of tinted it purple. Um, yeah, and I've got uh, Windows effects. On here, Stardock Windows effects, and um, it makes the windows explode when you you know x them out and fucking <laughs> uh, swirl off to the side or swirl up or bounce down or spin in, do all sorts of shit. Uh, you know, when you have it on random, it'll do just whatever. I don't even know what the fuck it's gonna do next. So um, yeah. Uh, that's kind of basically all I wanted to show you and shit. Um, I mean, there's all sorts of stuff I could tell you about this, you know, beyond showing you. Uh, the The name of this theme is Full Glass V7, or Full Glass VS7 V2. <clears throat> and... Um, I downloaded a lot of different themes and a lot of different programs trying to get my windows like this and they all fucked up or were fucking weak and fucking lame and shit. This 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 is the only thing that worked. And uh I think it's because the actual instructions were very clear and in English. You know the funny thing is all the people that I fucking <laughs> the videos that I watched, like, on this shit, like, most of them were, like, fucking Hispanic, you know, some Latinos, so it was all in, like, fucking Spanish and shit, and I couldn't fucking understand a word they're fucking saying. Um, so, uh, yeah, and, like, you know, of course, you know, there's always visual, you could, you could watch the, the video and learn from it, but the video was so bad that I could, couldn't even understand what they're doing. They don't know how to teach anyone to do anything. They're just kind of showing off their fucking shit, you know? I mean, uh, you, know, it, you know, I'm just kind of showing off my shit here, too. This is just like a demo. I'm not trying to teach you anything, or I would say tutorial, you know? I, there's little tidbits, like, you know, if I go full screen like this with the fucking window, it stops the dream scene. Uh, video desktop background from playing and then when you un uh, full screen it, it fucking goes back to playing and shit like that. That is a, a feature so that uh, it could stop the fucking video dream scene from fucking using too much CPU which you know it does um, it fucking you know if you're not if you don't watch it I mean the, these videos are like uh, uh, 856 by 480 or some shit like that. And uh, uh, that's 16 by 9, so it fits my screen. 
but it's like smaller than the actual real video so that it'll play without draining too much CPU. I get 1% to 3% CPU drain when I play these Dream Scene backgrounds, all right? Uh, and, um, sorry, I got interrupted there for a second. Uh, so I, the video kept playing, so uh, I decided to come back to another video and keep talking. Um, yeah, uh, it, it, where was I? Is CPU drain. CPU drain. Uh, I get 1-3%, to 3%, uh, but I found out when I tried to make another build, an, an, another hard drive, uh, that uh, if you don't have your fucking hard drive all fucking just tuned up and updated, the drivers are just updated to the fucking max or some fucking shit, I mean, you have to do some awesome shit to your fucking... Uh, could be to your hard drive and shit to, to just fucking make it just running fucking tuning nice to get that one to three percent because on these same videos without doing that I was getting like five to ten percent fuck it so that's something you need to know make absolutely fucking sure you are totally up to date and tuned fucking up if you want to get that one to three percent like I do off some 480p uh, 16 by 9 Here's something else I'll show you. It's uh, it's called Matto Date, and it like lets me make my Windows 3D. But I kind of think it's cheap. I mean, look at that. I mean, sure, it, it the Windows 3D, but it doesn't look as cool as the window did before you made it 3D. You know, <laughs> so it's like you know, this is an example. I I I went through tons of different fucking. PC customization fucking programs over the past weeks. I'm serious. And it's like, I would just run into shit like this, and it's just like, oh, hey, that's neat. You know, and it's like, fucking... But it's just kind of like, you know, it doesn't look as cool as you'd like it to, or it doesn't look as cool as it does on the fucking actual video and shit. I mean, look at that. I mean, the the actual folder background is a fucking uh, all black and shit. It's not the purple like that, okay? I mean, if it looked like that, but in 3D, that would be fucking cool. And now look, I got like two windows out, and the other one looks even fucking worse. It's like it only works halfway decent if you got uh, the effect going on one of them, you know? <laughs> so it's like, you know, so I've got that, you know, I mean, I could do some... 3D window shit, okay, but it just, you know, it just doesn't live up to the fucking promises, you know, and that's really, that's what I've been dealing with, you know, I mean, you know, there's a lot more going on in my life than this, but, you know, this is just like, you know, away from the editing and all this fucking shit, okay, this is something I've been working on a lot more is the PC customization and shit, and uh, that, so this video is kind of just about that, okay. You see, I mean, it's almost like don't even fucking bother with the 3D window shit. You know, everything's fine. Just leave them 2D. They look great 2D. Fucking fuck the 3D window shit. Um, yeah, but, um, yeah, the dream scene background shit, man. You know, I was espousing it before and preaching its fucking, singing its praises and shit like that. Because I thought that you'd get 1% to 3%. Like, everybody would get 1% to 3%. No, that is not the fucking truth. Honest to fucking God, I do not know why I get 1% to 3%. This drive, has, there's so much sh shit been done to this fucking drive. And I've, like, duplicated it over and over. This is an old build. Somewhere along the line, I got the fucking awesome drivers or some fucking shit, okay? Because if I try to do it fresh, I get 5 to 10%, not 1 to 3%. I can run in the same video, okay? So, yeah, just a little fact for you for people that are interested in the Dream Scene background shit. Anyway, um, God, what else can I show you? Um, let's, like, zoom in, like... Here, let me cut it and zoom in to uh, uh, the actual Firefox icon that I just made. The animated Firefox icon. Okay, this is like a prototype of a fucking Firefox, animated Firefox icon that I'm working on. 
This is like version one. This is not the final version. I am not satisfied with that at all. It needs a little bit more styling. I'd like to make a, an Earth myself out of Cinema 4D. Um, and uh, that looks like cooler and shit. And style that tail a little more and shit like that. But uh, the other one I had just, you know, was a little too low res for me. Here's something else cool. Or at least I thought it was going to be cool. Uh, it's, it's this special program that lets you, uh, make your drop shadow around your windows, like, a color. And, of course, you know, I chose purple to match the window, so it looks like it's got, like, this kind of neon glow around it and shit. And, uh, I was like, hey, that's cool. And the program's called YZ Shadow. And, uh, uh, but it has an issue. <laughs> Look at that. I, it's, I've seen it work for other people, but it didn't work for me. It does not want to stick to my windows. So it's just like, you know, oh well. <laughs> I mean, I'm actually looking into how I can do that myself in code or some fucking shit. Okay, we'll just turn it off. Um, yeah, so, uh, you know, there was another disappointment. I was serious, it's been one disappointment after another. Even getting these windows was a fucking problem. It was like, I mean, the first thing you have to know is uh, that you have to enable your Microsoft PC to be able to accept third-party themes, little customized themes. So you have to get a, a, a theme patcher. And there's lots of different ones out there, but you got to get one, and you got to make sure you do it so that your computer can actually accept their theme. I mean, there's no way I could do these transparent windows without the patcher. So first, you're going to need to get a patcher. All right. This isn't a tutorial, by the way. I'm just, you know, kind of showing you some stuff, kind of pointing you in the right direction, giving you stuff to think about and stuff like that. Okay. Um, but, uh, you know, you know, and, and someone needs to that speaks fucking English. I'm serious. Everyone out there is like typing or speaking Spanish or some fucking shit, okay? Speak clear, distinct English and know what you're talking about, okay? That's what I want. Where are the people that can do that, that know how to do this stuff, all right? Because I couldn't find them. I couldn't find them. You know, everyone that speaks English is like doing some dorky little, oh, here's my dorky little program above, you know, and it seemed like only the Latinos and stuff were into the really cool shit, you know, so it's like every time I found a program that I wanted to check out, and I would find a video on it to watch some sort of tutorial, it was always in Spanish, <laughs> that means like, only the Spanish-speaking people know what's cool, <laughs> okay, you know? anyway, um, yeah, you know, I did a lot more with the logon changer and the boot animation and everything, okay, the startup sound and all that, but it's kind of hard to screen cap that because the computer's booting up and everything. All right, let's give this a try. Yeah, I knew it. It's just too bright. Those are like chromey letters, 3D letters that say Windows Grim. And that's my, my business logo, the Grim Reaper in front of a moon that's like animated and shit, but it's really hard to see. Here's the actual letters in boot animation. Anyway, I'll leave it there. Grim out.